Hey, what's going on, you guys? Welcome back to another episode of Tales of Symphonia. Last time, I did a few side quests. I did the rest of the side quests off. Well, I did that line of recording, but they are going to be in the uh, bonus episode that will come after this series is done. So, look out for that when this is over, because we're almost approaching the end of this game, sadly. It's really close to being done, and I still have some stuff to show off, but not a lot more. I plan on doing the Coliseum, but I also plan on doing that on stream because that's going to take a while, completing it with all the characters that I can, and yeah. So I decided that will be a stream for some other time. Probably sometime before I get to the final boss because it would be kind of worthless to beat the final boss and then do it. I wouldn't get anything out of it. Uh, so this episode we're going to go to uh, the Tower of Salvation. Because we got the uh, Chosen's Gem, the stairs of Here first. reminds me of my journey to regenerate the world. But this time, we're here to cure your illness. I'm curious to see what the design of Tethayala's Tower of Salvation is like. Now, Zelos, open the door, quickly! You know, you can get really scary sometimes. He's got that right. <laughs> that, is, that is fact. Oh, yeah! Check me out! It's my time to shine! Do I look like a chosen or what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get going. <laughs> Roger. That's a very disturbing laugh. Celos, is something wrong? What? You're even more... Um, even more obnoxious than usual? Nah, he's always like this. Just ignore him. <laughs> She's pretty sharp. Such a sad place. Wait a minute. Is this really Tetheala? Yeah. It looks identical to Silveron's Tower of Salvation. My body... I can't stop shaking. This is the same place. It can't be. Lloyd, remember this? That's... Wait, I broke that. The two worlds are connected here. Of course, it's the same place. Kratos, it's you again. Who are you really? Are you really one of Mythos's companions from 4,000 years ago? Good. Since you figured that out, it saves me the time to explain. We will take the Chosen as the new body for Martel. You're still trying to do that? Are you so intent on resurrecting Martel that you're willing to distort the entire world in the process? I have no need to explain. So in the end, you really are our enemy. I kept thinking, hoping that you might be good, but you're not. I should think that would be obvious at this point. Don't hold back this time! And now, we have I round two improved. of Kratos. Take this! Judgment! Now, let's hope, uh... To do that. Oh, I forgot to put something on. Oh man. Rising Falcon! 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 Rising
for a while. I'm gonna use that on himself, okay. I don't think I have any magic uh, lenses yet. Sadly, I do not. But that's okay. Yeah, because Kratos attacks with the lightning, if you did not know, so reducing lightning uh, really helps if you can do that. Yeah, if you keep healing up, you should be okay with this fight. It shouldn't be too bad. And if you have rain, keep healing you. It should not really be that bad. The team that I really recommend is having rain, um... One person to tank damage, which for me that's Perseia, and then another attacker, oh lord. Well, you could really do anybody, I, you could do Genus if you wanted to, but the thing with Genus is that he, uh, he could use lightning unless you disable that on him. Oh, perfect time. Yeah, he's in over limit, so we're gonna wanna... Okay, I'm good. Rising Oh, that only hit him once, wow. Oh, that's still gonna do that, it's okay. It's really not gonna do much. Oh, that was a good combo. Got healed though. Rain doesn't really do anything to him, and that's what's really bad. You saw Rain did like one damage there. I had to get killed there. Oh, he's an over limit again. Okay. Yeah, attack per se, up, please. That is okay. Take this. And Rain needs uh, TP, okay. I need that. Oh, the reason why I keep having Rain do items is because I have a uh, compound skill, which makes it so that I Rain uh, can use more items in a short amount of time than other people. And he's done. 
I'll never lose to you. So I actually do not know if you can fail that fight. I know you can fail the first Kratos fight the first time you fight him. I don't know if you can fail that one. I really don't think you can. That can be a tough fight. You can see he's pretty strong of one. I would advise against resisting, for there will be no mercy this time. Are we still alive? Well, looks like we'll have our lives at least until they finish preparing Colette's treatment. Apparently she's useless the way she is now. Maybe we were tricked. He had us gather the materials to treat Colette, and then had us bring her here. That sure saved them a lot of time and effort. Kratos used us? Did he betray us again? Lloyd. I feel guilty for letting this happen to Colette and the others. I really want to know why I keep getting captured and getting thrown into jail all the time. <laughs> yeah, this is like the third you time sure I think. sure you haven't been doing anything to deserve it? We should just be glad we have our lives. Well, yeah. Damn it! This thing's built solid as a rock, and I can't open the lock either. <sighs> Same here. It won't budge at all. Can Colette or Perseo break it? No. I'm sorry I couldn't be of use. So we're completely trapped. Move. How did you do that? I originally specialized in fighting with my hands, not my feet. And since X-Spheres amplify their users' abilities far above their maximum limits, this result is to be expected. Then why don't you just fight with your hands? I swore I would never fight with these hands again. This time, I used them in order to save you, Lloyd. You're going to unite the worlds and save Colette, right? Yeah, that's right. All right. Everybody grab what you can, and let's get out of here. Man, imagine if Regal just uses his hands to fight that. <laughs> that was amazing. He had some, like, lightning technique out of his hands. That was great. Um, so, yeah, you can see we got a save point here, which that's... I'll save. I'm not going to save the other one just in case the recording gets messed up, and that'd be pretty horrible. I'd have to fight Kratos again. That was a pretty long fight, but, um, yeah. So you can see that teleporter is not on, so you cannot do anything there yet. There's only one way we can go, and that is over here. What the? That's weird. This is the transporter, right? There may be a problem with its destination. Man. What do we do now? We can't stay here. Lloyd, I'll go fly around and have a look. Okay, don't do anything dangerous. I know. Is she going to be alright? Let's let her handle it for now. Hmm. This, this box must be in the way. Holy city. Well, I think it's Walgaia. I could be wrong. I think it's Walgaia. I think that's how you say it. I am horrible at pronouncing these things. But yeah, so you want to move these boxes so that the teleporter is so that they're not on top of the teleporter. That should do it. That was fast. It looked like the problem was resolved. I know. Okay, let's go. caught if we keep wandering around here you're right we'll pretend to be colette's prisoners she should be fine because she's an angel okay character skit right away no matter where you look it's just angels 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 and they're all a bunch of look like a bunch of weird dolls dolls 
true. You can't tell what they're thinking. It's hard to believe that they're actually half elves, like the professor and genus. Am I the same? What? They remind me of myself. Am I really human? What are you talking about? Of course you're human. Yeah. I wonder. So yeah, you can talk to them, but they kind of just ignore you. They talk about the Great Seed, your grass seal, and I'm not even going to read them because that is uh, Ed Martell. Yeah, they're talking about all that. I don't really think it's necessary to talk to all of them. It's a strange city. There's something strange about this city, but I can't put my finger on it. There are many people here, but there is no feeling of actual daily life activity. That's probably why. Yeah, they're alive, but it's like they're dead. They aren't thinking anything at all. So it would seem. What Crucius is doing is wrong. So you can see the obvious conveyor belt over there that we have to go, but I think if you go this way, there is... There should be some chests. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, the nebulum keeps vibrating. And this is... Okay, let's try opening it. Apocalypse. Thought so, it's the Devil's Arms. Alright, let's see this one. That's for Regal. That means we only have one more to go. And I could have got that one, but I decided not to. I decided to wait on that, because I can't do anything else with it anyway. And there's nothing in that room. But yeah, remember to get this while you were here. Yeah, and, and I don't... There's like nothing on the other floors. I remember looking all around for chests, and it was worthless, because there was none, I think, when I did my first playthrough. Angels without soul. It looks almost... It looks like almost all the angels have lost their soul. Living for countless years, unable to even think. They can't feel happiness anymore. It's too sad. After looking at these guys in the city, I'm glad you didn't become an angel, Colette. Yeah, they just look like they're just walking around mindlessly. <laughs> like. Alright, so yeah, you obviously have to go this way. This is the obvious way to go. Hey, look at that. Giant transporter, perhaps. Maybe we use that to get back to the ground. You can see we can't go that way. I have some cool elevators though, I'm gonna give them that, that is uh, but it's kind of worthless because you don't, there's nothing up there at all that you would need, so I don't know why there's an elevator there. Most of this place is just for decoration and I kind of like that, I mean, it makes the city look a lot better, but. And up there and up here are shops, I believe. This seems to be the city's data bank. Professor, can you operate it? I'll try. Got it. Now we can get data from this terminal. Darius Carlon. Darius Carlon is protected by the force field emitted from the Eternal Sword. If this force field is removed, Darius Carlon will be released from the planet's gravity and will wander in space again as a, as a comet. World, world Elongation Project. <laughs> or the Eternal Sword. I'll read the Eternal Sword. The magic sword was given to the leader of Yggdrasil when he formed the Pact of the Origin. Its imme immense power is able to control time and space. It is said to be the source of the leader of Yggdrasil's power. Lord Yggdrasil was able to split the worlds with the power of the Eternal Sword. If this sword were to be lost, the leader of Yggdrasil's power would diminish, and Willagaya would surely face its doom as well. The world was split in two in order to keep the mana depletion to a minimum. 
It's just antis have seen the world and the seed of the giant tree. Additionally, the usage of the summon spirits to guard the mana links and restrict the flow keep the world from... No, I... Never mind. <laughs> I don't even know what that says anymore. I tried to read that, but no. <laughs> great... Great prosperity level... Or great prosperity leads to the possible development of magi technology, which causes meaningless wars. And that's it. Oh, I didn't know he was going to say anything. I didn't read that. We obtained some very, very valuable information. Lloyd, we shouldn't stay here long. Yeah, let's go. And yeah, I really don't think there's anything up here either. Besides this person. There is something up there though, which I'll go over there. Yeah, it is a shop. Okay. Which is actually really good because I need some more stuff. If you require something, purchase it at the vending machine. Yeah, it seems like he's a muscle robot, like, told to say that whenever somebody goes up there. What's this? Looks like some kind of information terminal. It's useless, it won't start up. Really? Oh, it started up. That's our Colette. I'm so glad I didn't break it. The terminal to the surface is located in the central area. You please use the emergency route located in the rear of the idea district while it is under maintenance. We need to go from the terminal, which leads to the surface after we get the mana fragment. Yeah, that just heals everybody. Really, that's all that does. Uh, it's not horrible. It's it's pretty good, but because that fight with Kratos, but it's not. I don't know. It's not really needed. I think. And I think this one is also a refresher. For some reason, there's two right next to each other. Not sure why. I think that's what this is. Yeah, I don't know why there's two. Doesn't make any sense to me, but. Let's look right here. And you can't look at that one. Okay. Nothing there. Nothing there. And then down here, I don't think there's anything yet, but uh, I'll look anyway. Don't want to miss anything. Nope, and... Nope. Those are just mirrors. That, for some reason, don't show void in them. So yeah, this is where you actually want to go. So yeah, you had to go over to that terminal over there to actually activate this. I was actually stuck here because I didn't know. Oh, this is where... Okay, I have to get the mana fragment first. I'll try going over here, but I think I know where the mana fragment is. You can't really do anything here. Wait. Show your identification. Uh, identification again. You, you're a human. He's being transported. He's being transported for an experiment. Excuse us. I don't have any identification. There's no choice. Once we get the mana fragment, let's use that emergency route. Yeah. So yeah, I know where the fragment is now. I just forgot. I think it is in that building with the ton of floors and the elevator.
Or wait, is it in here? Oh yeah, it's right here actually. There we go. Could I please have a fragment of mana? Fragments of mana are no longer being distributed. Return to your area. You won't give us one? A human? These are the subjects needed for the Crucius Crystal Research. High Xphere Research? I see. Now that you mention it, I've heard that research involving humans were being conducted. Yes, exactly. And we require a fragment of mana for that purpose. Understood. Then please show me your identification. Not again. Do we absolutely have to have that? Of course. Lord Kratos. We need a fragment of mana for the ritual of the Chosen. I've sent a courier over to pick it up. Understood. Yeah, that. That's us. Are you saying you're Lord Kratos' couriers? Uh, yeah. Silence, human. We're with Kratos. But just a moment ago, you said you were going to use it for high Xphere research. That's right. And it just so happens that it's also needed in the ritual, so we came to retrieve it. Please hurry. But without identification. Besides, you seem to be of the Desion class and have humans among you. While you're complaining about these little nitpicky details, you're keeping Yggdrasil waiting. Do you want to take him off? That's right. Lord Yggdrasil is scary if you cross him. Uh, all right. <laughs> they got him. Sure you get it. Lord Yggdrasil. And we acquired the mana fragment. It was pretty easy. <laughs> all you had to do was bring up Yggdrasil and then he was just scared. All right. So now we can use that emergency exit, because we cannot go out the front way because the identification is needed and all that. So we are going to go to the side way, which I was actually stuck here like I was saying before because I did not uh, notice if you had to look at that specific terminal to actually open the way to leave, which is kind of weird. I just, it's pretty confused. I got the mana fragment and I was like, where do I even go? <laughs> Looks like this is the emergency exit. Okay, let's, let's go before anyone sees us. No, looks like they've already found us. That, that's them. They're the ones that pretended to work to be working for Lord Kratos. It's the Chosen. The Chosen Man has escaped. Let's get out of here. I'll follow them. You report to Lord Yudra Lord Yudrasio. <laughs> Understood. Okay, well, now we run away from them. Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. Do I want to get into a battle? I mean, I don't think I actually do. I think I'm good. <laughs> There's a chest here, though. Yeah, I'm level 3, wow. I really have to start using them. I started using them for some people. Not all of them. It looks like we're fighting him. You want to tussle? Huh? I was just warming up. So not that way. Who's that for? Um, that is for rain. Okay. That is good. All right. A lot of easy chests in here to find. I don't know, and a lot of EXM level threes. Okay. 
Oh, I love that sword. That's for Zolus. It looks like a lightsaber. Alright, and we have another chest here. That is for Shinobi. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. So yeah, there's actually nothing else on here yet. Because I need the stupid Sorcerer Ring change, but I don't know where that is. Don't hate me because I'm beautiful. <laughs> Ready? That was so easy. Okay, Ring got extra XP, which is good. Alright. I'm so glad for uh missing encounters like that. Alright. Let's go all out. Beast! Yeah, that, uh, one move uses a ton of TP. I think it uses, like, 45. Okay, per se, go. Gotta find the sorcerer ring. Um, could be this way. No, we have to fight him. It's fine. I need XP in the way. Oh wow, I can't get that interrupted one. Not even a contest. Got him. Okay. That was good. Oh no, this one's gonna find me, isn't it? Actually, no. Good. Whoa, I'm floating. So this is weightlessness. What's that? While on the ground, the man up for gnome. By summoned spirit of earth. Gives rise to the effect known as gravity. The reason we fall to the ground from a high place is because gnome's power pulls us. This place is so far away from the ground that gnome's power doesn't reach. And so we float like this? He had an annoying attitude, but I guess Gnome is a pretty important summon spirit. Be careful, move slowly. Once you start moving, you won't stop till you hit something. Yahoo, this is fun. <laughs> Zealous is just... Ah. Uh. Yeah, I'll be careful. I hate this place. It's a slide puzzle, and you know how much I hate those. Those are not my favorite thing to do. Okay, we got a character something. I wonder how high up we are. Or how, how high up are we? We're inside the Tower of Salvation, after all. Are we higher than the clouds? We can see the stars around us. So we have to... No, I couldn't read that. Oh yeah. So strange. Normally, looking at the stars make me feel safe, but now I feel scared. Don't worry, I'll protect you. I'll never let Crucius have you. Yeah, I'm not scared as long as you're with me. Let's hurry back to the surface and get your endless cure. Yeah.
Yep. Empty silent world. Are you okay, Persea? You don't look well. My head is aching and... And? I don't like it here. This empty silent world. It feels like a world of death. I want to go back to the surface. Me too. Let's go back together to our world. Yes. Where am I trying? Oh, I'm trying to end up down there. Wow, okay. There's nothing over here, but I might as well work. Oh, no, there's nothing. So many character skits here. This weightless stuff is a little hard to handle. Once you get used to it, it's pretty fun, Lloyd. Just imagine invading, <coughs> inviting a crow you like up here. You could have fun in all sorts of ways that you could normally. Zelos. Zelos, why? It's totally like Zelos, it's just. Yep. I can't believe that. Alright. Confused right now. still very confused about this area. This area is really confusing as you can see. But, uh... Not. Oh, I guess I'm fighting now. Get ready. Okay. All right. That was not that bad. All right. So I can't go in there yet, so I gotta go this way, probably. Oh 
wait, I can go that way. Somehow. a long area. You can kind of tell this is one of the last areas of the game. Pretty much is the last area. I did it, yes. <laughs> I don't know if this is where I have to go, but you know, I did it. Oh, I'm fighting him now. This is gonna be cake. Okay. I was just warming up. I don't know if this is gonna actually help at all, but I'm gonna try. No, that's a blue. I'm going to actually end this episode here once I grab this chest. I have to find a save point though before I can end, so I gotta look for one. Of course, I'm just trying to run. Alright, let's go! Let's get out of here! Are you okay? Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Gotta know when to go!
and thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and see you guys next time.